back to my channel and uh, so I'm here in Zanzibar and uh, we are going to check out uh, the street food my voice is kind of hoarse you can hear but uh, so you are going to come along with me it's going to be sampling street foods and uh, so yeah let's see what uh, life in Zanzibar and uh, in terms of our food is really about and uh, so the market we are going to it's uh, an open market for street foods and uh, it's called uh, Forodani Market, so come along. So the best thing about uh, this market, uh, Forodhani market, is the fact that uh, there's a wide variety of uh, food uh, to choose from, all the way from uh, fruits, bread, meat, seafood, drinks, name them. Like uh, there's a wide variety of uh, food to choose from and uh, they are quite well priced, like uh, very affordable. Uh, so as you can see, there's a... Uh, meat like there's beef there's chicken there's uh, octopus uh, you can see kingfish you can see calamari you can see like there's a wide variety of food honestly as you can see and uh, looking so like uh, the food is screaming your name right uh, looking so uh, delicious uh, so what we did is uh, skim through the market because there are so many food vendors uh, skim through the market so that we could uh, uh, decide on what we really want and uh, let me tell you the more you walk the more confused you get <laughs> yeah and uh, this was really really amazing like the food is looking so appetizing huh? i sweet. love this if you don't like have sweet we have a spiced chili that chili goes give you flavor and appetizer and something like that after that i add my corn on that bowl because it's hot so it makes lubricant right so when I leave it for a while I mix it with when I, when I take a pepper manga you know so I put a little bit pepper she order honey butter so I don't need to put uh, lemon so I just mix it up after mix it up so the flavor it will become honey plus butter this is like dessert so whenever you eat this one kind of like a spiced chili and lemon pepper it gives you appetizer it's good for healthy and vegetarian so this food is gonna eating around all around the world india brazil mexico dubai abu dhabi whatever south africa uh, mexico us even what they say uh, argentina the one who wins the Mary. Ah, sorry, octopus. <laughs> Tuna. Let's try something else. Beef. And uh, finally for the cubs, we call this samosa, so it's a beef samosa.
this is a little bit different because uh, in Kenya the meaty part or rather not the meat but the cover which is uh, wheat is uh, a little bit uh, thin this one is so thick so but still I would say I prefer the Kenyan one because I don't like it uh, when it's this uh, thick yeah so but it's yummy so I'm enjoying so I'm uh, finally done with my meal and uh, so that was so yummy I enjoyed it and uh, my voice today wants to stop reggae but uh, not gonna happen because uh, we are here to have some fun huh? so uh, after this I want to take some uh, fruit and uh, after that I'll take uh, a drink, uh, some juice, then uh, we call it a night. So uh, one thing I love about uh, this market is the fact that uh, you get to eat a balanced diet at uh, a very cheap uh, price, which is uh, awesome because uh, you enjoy and uh, you get to save your money. And uh, yeah, so, so far I'm enjoying, loving the place and uh, yeah, so... I'll uh, keep you updated as uh, the night goes by. So let me go get some food and uh, then uh, we eat together because uh, we are in this together, right? I hope you are loving the vlog so far. If you are, kindly consider to give it some love. Give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comment section if uh, you've been to uh, this market and uh, rather if uh, you've been to Zanzibar and uh, if uh, you've been here. How was uh, your stay for, for it? Like, uh, how was your stay and uh, what did you love about it? If you are not, then uh, let me know. Would you love to visit this place? Because uh, uh, it's my first night here and uh, so far I'm loving it. Like, uh, food is uh, good and uh, you get to eat balanced diet. It's a very cheap price. So, this is awesome and uh, see you in a few. So yes, I did get a bowl of uh, fruit, but unfortunately, I didn't film that. I forgot. <laughs> it was that good. Uh, so later came for sugarcane juice. And uh, as you can see, uh, this guy is squeezing uh, juice from uh, the sugarcane by rotating this wheel. And uh, one thing that I couldn't stop admiring, uh, <laughs> his biceps. Just look at his biceps. Oh my God. He's really built, huh? He's really built. So anyway, that aside, uh, so that bucket has uh, ice cubes. So the sugarcane juice is uh, uh, sieved and uh, it's really good. So cold, like really needed this, huh? I felt nice, huh? I really loved it. So it's uh, the next morning and uh, taking a walk down uh, Stone Town looking for breakfast. And uh, the goal was to look for breakfast that... Uh, the common uh, Stone Town resident or rather Zanzibar resident takes. Uh, not anything we can find elsewhere. We wanted something that uh, screams uh, Stone Town. Uh, so, of course, feeling myself. Huh? <laughs> yeah, so uh, this place is looking uh, really clean. Uh, the sun is out. And uh, can you imagine uh, that uh, this place is uh, the same for Rodani Market that we were at last night? Like, this is the same place, huh? You can't even imagine, right? Uh, the beach looking clean. And, uh, like, the area is really clean that uh, you can't imagine it was filled with uh, food vendors last night, buyers and uh, people eating. So, I love how they've maintained the cleanliness of uh, this for Rodani Market. Uh, so, continue uh, with our walk because, remember, we are looking for breakfast. Uh, so came to this uh, restaurant over here and uh, nothing really caught our eye. So we proceeded and uh, ended up at uh, Darajani Market, as you can see. And like the other side of uh, Stone Town, this place is alive. Like we've got vendors and uh, as you can see, a lot of uh, fresh uh, fruits, vegetables. And uh, you know Zanzibar is known for spices. Uh, so... Uh, a lot of uh, spices as well, as you can see. Uh, that is vanilla over there, the black substance. Never seen vanilla before. And uh, yeah, the goal is uh, looking for breakfast, remember. So the journey continues. Uh, uh, so walked and uh, ended up here. Oh my God. This breakfast, uh, this breakfast, oh my God. <laughs> it really slapped. Like it was really, really nice. That is uh, uh, soup. 
from uh, fish and uh, the chunk of meat you see there is fish uh, tuna that is kingfish i believe like it really it was good hey it was good and of course some tea to take everything down ha ah, this breakfast really slapped so we really enjoyed this and uh, yeah i would uh, love to wake up to such breakfast every day and it had the soup had uh, uh, was made with uh, mango so it had that sour taste that was really nice i loved it honestly loved it so after breakfast it was time to check uh, some souvenirs from uh, the market and uh, yeah that brings us to the end of uh, today's uh, vlog uh, thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this as much as i enjoyed filming it and uh, drop a comment and share what uh, you loved most about uh, this vlog and uh, see you in the next one bye